Good morning everybody and welcome to today's vlog. Today is Wednesday, it is almost 9 o'clock and me and Frederick are going out today. We were going to go with a bunch of friends but everyone's not coming with us but that is okay. So we are going on an adventure, just me and this little guy. It was definitely my fault why my friends aren't coming. I left it to the last minute to invite them all out for the day. And unfortunately, none of them could make it today. So me and Frederick have just basically decided that we're just going to go off on our own and hopefully we're going to have a magical, amazing day today. Now that we finally have the keys of Frederick, we can head off. So today we are going to an island. I'm really excited for it. We're going to Penguin Island today. Super excited for it because I haven't been to Penguin Island since I was, I don't know, a couple of years old. That's the last time I remember going. Um, so it will be interesting to see what it is like these days. It will probably most likely be exactly the same. But um, we'll just see when we get there. Got to where the ferry takes us over to Penguin Island and you probably can hear a bunch. Come on darling. You probably can hear a bunch of people talk behind us because there is a lot of people behind me, like a lot. Um, so you probably can hear all the chatter in the background. But we've came to this little playground right here. Frederick is obviously on the ground having some fun in the, the sand. We've got about 30 minutes to wait until the ferry um, comes and picks us up. So I thought we would come over and have a little play to try and what is kill the tarn. That is the word, kill the tarn. beach to ourselves I'm not kidding you like we've got the entire beach to ourselves I feel like people don't come to this side because you have to trek over this side quite a bit but I knew this side was much better than the other side to swim so we've come over here and we've got the entire beach to ourselves and it's absolutely stunning Frederick's not the biggest fan of the beach, but at least he's got all his gear and tired. We finished our swim and we came down to come down to the ferry and we missed it unfortunately. So we had to wait for the next one, which will be here in 20 minutes. So we're going to go catch that one back over to the mainland, as they say here on the island. It's hilarious. Um, I'm getting bugs all over me. I had like a spider crawl on me before and it was really creepy. Patrick passed out on the way to the ferry, so he's actually right here laying down fast asleep. He's, he's passed out. Um, so I'm hoping he stays asleep until um, we get back into the car and he stays asleep all the way home, all the way into his bed and he just stays there all day. Um, well not all day but you know he just sleeps but it's been really nice to just chill out without Fred the hassle of you know looking after Frederick or watching where Frederick is and everything it's been really nice just to sit here and just hear the birds see the water and just enjoy the amazing views here you will never understand why people who have kids get them changed after the beach and just let them walk around naked. I will never understand why people do that. I'm someone who can't do that. I'm someone who keeps Frederick's body very private, especially when we're out in public, even changing nappies in front of people I feel weird. Um, but especially when we're at the beach and there's other people around, you have no idea who who's watching you, you have no idea who they are, but I think it's funny that people just, it's like they think it's okay just 
to let their kid walk around butt naked like you wouldn't do it so why would you let your kid do it i just i don't know if that maybe you guys don't agree with me let me know if you agree with me or not because i really want to know if people agree with me or not but it's just down here sleeping we're going to pick him up in a second and we're going to walk down to the dock and hop on the ferry. One hour later. We've got home. Frederick is down there having some lunch. He decided he was just going to wake up and stay awake. So he probably won't be napping at all now today, but that's okay. I'm going to quickly jump into the shower. I was going to, I was going to think about having a nice relaxing bath. But honestly, I just want to jump in the shower. So, I'm just going to jump in the shower and we're going to get all fresh and clean, get out of these clothes, get the salt water off me and all the sand because I have sand everywhere. That's the only bad thing about going to the beach is you literally get sand on every single part of your body. Every single part. I don't know what bathing suit I wore today. This is the one I picked out and put on my body today. It is actually from cotton on body. It is just one of those like high rise bikinis ones that go like all the way up here. But um, I'm not doing that that high because I don't think this mum can get away with it. But yeah, it is just this bathing suit. It's not really the most flattering, I don't think, on my mum boat. But um, we're just gonna deal with it. I really like it, I like the color of it. And everything like that. But yeah, we still wore it and we still rocked it. Now that I'm out of the shower and I'm all clean, I thought I would show you guys what I'm wearing for the rest of the day. So I've just got these bikey shorts on. They're just really short really comfortable. I really like to wear them when I'm like lazy and I don't feel like wearing anything else other than these. And I've also just got a tee on because, well, it's super duper duper hot so I'm not going to wear anything else but this. My camera dies and before I have to put you on charge, last vlog that happened we were doing our playroom and you guys didn't actually end up seeing what the playroom looked like. We kind of left it like a suspense for you guys. I'm gonna quickly show you now because it looks absolutely amazing. We ended up finishing it that night. It only took us a couple of hours, um, but we ended up finishing it that night and we are so happy with it. Is what our playroom looks like now. We don't have brown carpet anymore. It looks so nice, so fresh, so new. It echoes in this room, unfortunately, so we'll have to get a bigger rug. Plus this rug belongs in Frederick's room. We just put it in here, hoping it would work, but it hasn't. But it looks so much nicer without the divider of like floors to carpet. It's just like one transitional like floor. It's been a little while. It is now 4, 4.30, I think. I think it's about 4.30. And we are just chilling in bed. I'm here looking like an ugly slug again. Like I said in my other video the other day, I'm just chilling as an ugly slug. But I was actually going to start cooking tea so I didn't have to worry about cooking tea during witching hour. That's okay, darling. During witching hour. But um, this guy here, little Frederick, decided that he was going to wake up. He doesn't. Oh, now mummy's really looking like an ugly slug. <laughs> looking down angles are really bad for these ugly slug moments. Um, so yeah, we're not cooking tea now. So I'm just going to chill here with Frederick a little bit while he comes down. And then we're going to cook tea together. I fell back asleep so now I can cook in peace. Even though it is quarter to five now and he is still asleep. He's obviously going to stay up quite a bit tonight because he is sleeping very, very, very late. But that's okay. I'm just going to deal with it even though I'm exhausted from the beach today. I'm just going to deal with it. So we're going to shove some pasta on um, and I'm going to chop up some vegetables.
this is dinner tonight it's literally a bunch of random stuff that probably won't end up tasting good but we're gonna give it a go now all i need to do is go wake up frederick and hope he's not a cranky little butt when i wake him up oh my god he's so cute frederick wake up darling wakey wakey it's dinner time soon i'm gonna wake up no don't want to oh stretchy stretchy that was fast get up you seen it mommy didn't hide it well enough and you back down Come on, Mr. Wakey Wakey. Pop. <laughs> Pop. Uh -huh. Do you want to show everybody that you can... Well, Donna was just about to say that. Did you want to show everybody you can say Mummy's name? Daddy. What's Mummy's name? Amy. Oh no. Can you say Amy? Ah. Can you say Amy? Amy. Oh well done, you're such a cutie. <laughs> I actually have no idea how Frederick learnt my name. He just said it today and I was just like you know my real name you know my real name you know my real name and he can say it so well can you let's just say it. my hair is absolutely atrocious right now it's atrocious Frederick Mwah. but we're going to actually get going so I hope you all enjoyed today's vlog if you did please give it a big thumbs up what do you think Freddie a big thumbs up yeah we have to teach you this one. A big thumbs up from Freddy. Um, and also, if you guys want to see more from us, hit that subscribe button. It would really mean a lot to us. But we'll see you guys all tomorrow. Say bye. Eh? <laughs> see you guys.